I want to tell you my secret now. Hi guys, this is a tutorial on how I am going to change my blender settings today. I think I got a um, question a while back how I changed my blender settings and I just got a hang of this screen recording. Um, I got a program that I actually like. So I'm going to go ahead and show you guys exactly how I do that. I'm just opening up Blender here, and I'm just waiting for the program to load. In this tutorial, you will learn how to change the background, even the grid itself, different colors. And I'll go ahead and show you that. I'll show you exactly where the colors are and how you can change them to your preference and how you know you just make it your own do whatever you want with it it's your blender so here we go might want to just click on the screen to get rid of the blender icon there you go up to file you scroll down to user preferences and a window should pop up for that you're going to want to scroll over to the themes area that is actually where all of your colors are and if you look at the left hand side where I'm where I, my mouth is that's pretty much where you change every color of anything in blender so I think I'm gonna change some of the buttons here these are just the preset colors here for your blender you can adapt these however you want to so these are color selections that you might want to go ahead and do and I just wanted to go ahead and show you guys how to do some basic things. I'm just clicking on this to show you you can actually change the color of this area here. I don't think I changed that. I left it just like it was because I wanted this exactly the way it was. I didn't want to change anything here. So I'm just going to go down to 3D view. I'm going to click on there. And then I'm going to change a few settings here. And as you can clearly see, it says lamp. It says the, the sun and all that right there. You can change that. And then we're on this screen here. This is for the user preferences, like the user screen here. These gray areas that you see bordering all of the Blender program. You can actually change those colors. I'm just brightening up everything here. Boom. You saw that? Just brightening up everything to a nice um, lighter color so I can see it better. So this is how you brighten up the, the buttons here, the active and inactive buttons. So if you wanted to do that, you would actually go to this setting here at the very top of things to your left-hand side. And right above that is a darker um, gray box that is actually for the themes. There are themes that actually come with Blender, and you can actually change those as you would like as well. Um, those are preset, and you can actually scroll um, that button down and change whatever color you want it to. That's me just trying to adjust some colors here. Um, before, as, as I said, the buttons on the screen here to make them better to see. And you can see the pink color as I change some of the views. I went ahead and changed that to pink. What can I say? I'm a woman. I like pink. I like blue too. Who says a woman can't like blue? Okay, I'm girling it up a little bit. Let's see here. Okay. You can actually, I mean, it's pretty clear cut. <laughs> whatever you, you're changing, whatever color you want to change, you can use these buttons here. I'm not going to get very specific because I am not going to underestimate um, any of you guys. So I'm going to just assume that you can actually read and everything, of course. Um, so I'm not going to insult your intelligence. 
and you know go in a great great detail but you can actually see a clear cut right in front of your face exactly what colors you're changing and where so this area here is actually for the actual blender program colors you, there are so many things you can do with blender to customize it um, this is just one of the aspects the colors here I just wanted to show you guys exactly how to do that and where to go. It's pretty much self-explanatory when you get down to it and you look at exactly the name beside the color, so we're not going to get into that. And here we are. I think this is 3D view. And you know, you can see the lamp colors and all that. Um, the light, the camera, whatever color you want that to be, you would change it here. I'm just right just messing around color here for the lamp to let you see the color change for the lamp. I think it went from white to yellow. I just made it a darker yellow. Or a deeper yellow. Here. Now I'm gonna change this particular Now that's the grid color. If you look closely, you'll see the grid change. This is for the lines, the grid lines. And I'm gonna change that. I'm gonna lighten it up first, and then I'm gonna change that color. And of course you would scroll up to get lighter. Okay, and then you would change the position on the little radio dial to change whatever color. I just made it a light white color. A light blue. I'm just adjusting it to the way I like it. This is how you change the grid color. There we go. Let's see here. Ooh, that was it. Yeah, leave it right. So with the face highlights on your blender object, you can actually change that color here. So you're going to make that pink. Scroll down. And you just scroll down. I think I'm going to go um, and see about changing the background colors for you guys. So you can actually see how I did the gradient effect on my blender screen. So let me show you that right now. As you can see, oops, let me go over here. Change this really quickly. I'm just making that a little lighter so I can see that. Okay. Okay, change that one. Let me do it again. So I'm gonna make that green. And there we go. Alright, now I'm gonna scroll down, you guys. Uh, make a few more changes. Okay. Oh. Whew, I just fell out my chair. And you see the gradient colors here. That is that um, sea foam color, that sea foam bluish greenish, and the pink color. Those are my two gradient colors. I'm going to change those um, just to demonstrate how to change the colors of those. So here we go. I'm going to change this blue color first, or the pink color. Start with the pink. Change that to like a blue. 